people here today? Yeah. yeah. It looks like they're all waiting for something to happen. I don't know. What could possibly be happening? I don't here? know. Yes. Well, I mean, we have all these people here. Sing us a pithy one, Alex. All right. You want a pithy one? Oh, a lovely yeah. pithy one. All right. Um, I don't think what I got. All right, all right, I got one, I got one. You got one? Yeah, it's right. Young Smith. The Lusty Young Smith. I love this one, it's so yeah. naughty. Yeah. A lusty young smith and his vice stood a file and his hammer lay by while his forge still aglow. When to him a buxom young damsel came smiling when asked if to work in a forge he would go. Rum, 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 in and out, in and out, rum, rum. Rum, 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 in and out, in and out. You know what? There's kids in the audience. This might not be. A good yeah, no, it's. <laughs> <laughs> all right, I'm, trying, I'm trying to save the album. How, how about a ballad? How about a, a ballad? ballad? All right. I'm going to stand on a rock for everyone in the back. All right. I'm right. 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 I have a medical disorder. It's called being vertically challenged. Yes. <laughs> all right. Well, um, there has to be one. I, uh, yes. And vertically enhanced. Exactly. So you have to balance one another exactly. out. Exactly. You know, yin and yang. I think that's what the Chinese call it something. All right. Ah, uh, it's just called the Black Kiss of Colour. That's just Kiss for all of the dark hair. Mm -hmm. uh, oh, yes. the Prepare to swoon, ladies. Are there Prepare any? Are there any? Oh, no, maybe not. All right. I'll see a few. Black is the colour of my true love's hair. Oh, Her lips oh. are like two roses fair. The sweetest smile and the gentlest task. I love the ground where all the sheep are. Oh, goodness, they're saying. Pardon me. How dare he interrupt me? Pardon me. The next man makes a fat fryer joke is getting run over. Pardon me. Pardon me. Pardon me. Pardon me. down for a bit of rest before delivering this fine feast to Her Majesty and Her Ladies-in-Waiting, as Aaron asked me to do. Her Majesty is a kind soul and generous with her servants, and I'm sure she would not mind if I took a bit of refreshment as payment for my labors. But what a shame, I have no, no one to share my repast, especially if it is said that it is a sin to drink alone. to me in this solitary place, no one being by, yet if thou wilt have me say so, I do love thee as thou lovest me. Nay, will not I have a drink of good Malmsey? After thee, lad, after thee. Nay, sweeten the draught with thy lips. Oh, and thou would force it upon me, so this needs do thy bidding. Though I take it, and I drink to thy very good health. Now, sweet Chuck, tis your turn next. I take it, lad, and he is wishing thee all the good that thou wishest me. Ah, now, canst thou not sing me a song? Nay, I be but an ill voice today. Nay, thy voice is as sweet as any bullfinch. Come, sing, I prithee. <laughs> Alas, my love, you do me wrong To cast me off this courteous leer <laughs> I never did see a man so content with his own company! <laughs> oh, Friar, thou art nigh to committing the sin of gluttony. For the sake of thine own soul, I shall relieve thee of temptation. That's not water. <laughs> Robin comes nigh. I shall conceal myself and have some sport with him. <laughs> now there's a lusty infant. Gentlemen, ascend to the heavens and watch out his dad. Go on, watch out his dad, I'm Robin. 
What ho, Friar? Come no nearer, sinner! Whilst I may not be a man of God as thou art, I hope I'm no more sinner than any child of Eve. Well, thou art a reprobate and an outlaw. Didst thou not this day rob our good queen of her lawful tax money? It would appear so to those who know not the circumstance. Speak not to me of appearances. For lo, the devil hath the power to assume a pleasing shape. Uh, if I might but just sit and talk with thee. Ah, but perhaps me not, lest the vile contagion of thy sin or well my saintly nature. Right. I see thou not to be reasoned with. I shall trouble thee no more, say that it must pass thee by and cross this Thanks bridge. Pardon me. Rogue! Villain! To take from our poor mendicant his only sustenance? I have taken not from thee but spleen, <coughs> which it would appear thou hast in abundance. Go thou, boy. God has given me the calling to chastise such as thee, and return thee to the path of righteousness. Beg my forgiveness, and I shall let thee go without punishment. I ask forgiveness of thee, when thou hast abused me so roundly. <laughs> Called my character into question, refused to suffer my explanations, and now threaten my body. I will not. Dear Lord, give me the strength to do thy work, and to bring this humble sinner to recognize the error of his ways. God be praised. <laughs> sinner again? Come on, then. There we are, Robin. Come on. Oh! Briar! It would appear thou hast been dipping into the sacramental wine. A bit. Cool. Aha! How appropriate! The friar turned the other cheek. <laughs> That's too. Watch it. Impressive. Very impressive. Uh, not received in heaven yet. Hello! Oh, oh, oh. 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 <laughs> I prithee no more. My side shall surely split, and thou can split one another's mates. Twas all in good fun. Sit down. Be friends. John, what make you here? Oh, I'd come upon this curtal friar as he slept, in hopes to save him from the sin of gluttony. I relieved him of his repast, and when I heard thine approach, thought it my duty to teach thee a lesson in humility by relieving the sin of pride as well. I did not think the lesson to have ended so merrily. So it was thou didst take my wine, eh? Uh-huh. It would seem, sir, that I do owe thee an apology, and that I, good friar, owe one to thee. What of this fellow here? Has he not owed us well for the care that he has shown for our souls? Truly, brother, such lessons cannot go unrecompensed. Look be thy name. I be hype Friar Tuck. Well, that slips glibly off the tongue. Well, Friar, tuck in. Oh, here we go. Come on, Robin. <coughs> hey, John, here you hand. Thanks, Will. There we are. <laughs> All right. Let's have some fun, shall we, lads? Woo! Ha <laughs> ha! John's Bridge. Little, read the sign, Tiny! <laughs> oh wait, you can't! Oh, that's hitting below the belt! <laughs> John, yeah. this is just like the time we fought Archibald III! Archibald III, the third, the crazy noble with the aquarium! Yeah. They have thrown the fish at us! <laughs> that was a great time! Uh-oh. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, watch this. Oh, God. <laughs> 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 